Speaking of, uh, <laughs> speaking of quoting Hitler, Hitler quoting candidate wins North Carolina Republican gubernatorial primary. Mark Robinson, who has a history of making inflammatory comments, will face Democrat Josh Stein in what's expected to be a close race in November. Mark Robinson, North Carolina's lieutenant governor, who has a history of making inflammatory comments, has said he would abolish abortion rights, has won state's Republican nomination for governor. Robinson, North Carolina's first black lieutenant governor, will face Democrat Josh Stein to face uh, the state's attorney general in what's expected to be a close and hotly contested race in November. Robinson and Stein are attempting to succeed, uh, succeed the current Democratic governor, Roy Cooper, who is term limited. Because Republicans already control North Carolina's legislature, a Robinson victory would give them a trifecta and unilateral control over policymaking in a critical battleground state. Issues like the right to abortion would be at stake. Robinson said last month that he would absolutely protect life from conception. We got it down to 12 weeks, he said. The next goal is to get it down to six and to just keep moving from down there. A former factory worker, Robinson launched his political career when his 2018 speech on gun laws on, to his hometown council went viral. During that speech, Robinson said he represented average Americans who feel targeted and whose safety feels threatened by attempts to restrict firearms access. The attention following the speech earned him a spot as a conservative commentator and a National Rifle Association board member, and he used his new fame to launch a successful bid for a lieutenant governor. He has a history of controversial statements. He described COVID-19 as a globalist conspiracy to destroy Donald Trump. In 2021, he criticized efforts to teach LGBTQ issues in sex education, referring to transgender and homosexual people as filth. He also said people who are gay are equivalent to what the cows leave behind, as well as maggots and flies. This is my favorite type of person who will be like, we have to kill every gay person, but won't say shit. Like the word shit. Okay. It's like, oh, that would be a bridge too far. <laughs> Typical <laughs> average Southerner. Okay. He implied at a campaign event last month that transgender women should be arrested if they use, a, if they use women's uh, restrooms. He once described a black, uh, the movie Black Panther as created by an agnostic Jew and put the film by a satanic Marxist. He then said it was only created to put the, pull the shekels out of your... Okay. Dude. That's Hitlerian. In 2014, he quoted Hitler on Facebook in a statement about racial pride. He defended the post... In a speech last July, saying, quoting the Nazi leader, doesn't equate to supporting him. Because you quoted Hitler, you support Hitler, he said. I guess every history book in America supports Hitler now. They all quote him. I know the word is, is uh, a Yiddish slur for black people. That's why I didn't read it. <laughs> Which is wild. He said, black people owe reparations to white people? I have to see what his takes are on... That's awesome. This is just like this perfectly, this, this, this title, this headline perfectly captures Israel support in America, like almost entirely. Okay. When we talk about like Christian Zionism, which is the dominant Zionism in the United States of America. Okay. People that hyper focus on like, Jewish people supporting Israel lose sight of the actual very valid and very sizable constituency of anti-Semitic Christian Zionists. Okay. Like it's so, cause like as far as support for Israel goes, 
in the uh, American Jewish population, okay, the demographics work itself out in almost identical percentages to the rest of the demographics, like the, to the rest of the, the American public. Younger Jews, less in support of Israel than older Jews in the same exact way that younger like Christians and younger Muslims, well, maybe with Muslims is a little bit higher, but overall, overall, it is almost identical to the average, okay? This is the reason why I think a lot of people lose sight of the conversation and think that this is like a Jewish issue. It is not, okay? There are more Christian Zionists in America than there are Jewish people in the entire world. Absolutely. Moderate GOP opponent says Trump back frontrunner Mark Robinson is unelectable, presumptive Democratic nominee Josh Stein, if elected, would be the state's first Jewish governor. North Carolina gubernatorial candidate accused of Holocaust denial touts Israel's support. This race will be the embodiment of this meme. Bland normie dem. Adolf fucking Hitler. <laughs> but it's so American. It's like Adolf Hitler, but black. <laughs> and it's so sick. Now check out what the New York Times put for their initial sub headline on who is Mark uh, Robinson. There needs to be a New York Times headline generator where you could plug in terms like Holocaust denier and it spits back phrases like fiery outsider eager to dive into the culture war. Who is Mark Robinson? The Republican nominee for North Carolina governor. Subtitle reads, Mr. Robinson formerly entered politics in 2019 when he began his run for lieutenant governor. He has since earned a reputation as a fiery outsider eager to dive into the culture war. What is the culture war? Oh, World War II, as a matter of fact, it seems. You know, on not on the side of the Allied forces either, mind you, but on the side of the Nazis. He said, I'm doing World War II, but not on the side of America. Oh, my God. Yeah, he said, because you quoted Hitler, you support Hitler, he said. I guess every history book in America supports Hitler now. They all quote him. Oh. That's, I just, Mark Robinson running as a black politician who thinks black people owe white people reparations. Uh, this is this is also like basically at the heart of of uh, black conservatism and black Republicans in this country. This literally is the meme that defines black conservatism in this country specifically. He's just taking it to the next level. You know what I mean?